I was talking with a speaker named Jason from the Speak Pro Academy, and I don't want to say that I'm brilliant, but I'm brilliant. And so what I told Jason to do is uh, what I tell a lot of speakers to do in general is you don't just look for events in, in your area. You don't just say, okay, this is the, the, the one group, the, the one market that I'm going to contact. These are just the one people. What you do is you kind of look for verticals and you, you look to see who else is similar in the industry, but they're not necessarily competing with you. So. I told uh, Jason to actually connect with some AV guys, uh, just audio and visual guys, because whenever you're doing an event, if you're speaking at an event, who else is there? I mean, who else is involved in events? And AV guys, they always need the AV guys. There's always the hotels, there's caterers, things like that. So these people, if you connect with them, and they plug you in, then you can actually get more events. And so that's what I told Jason to do. I said, hey, connect with these AV guys in your, in your area, start talking with them, network with them, and that's what he did, and he networked with them so well that now he's pretty much just getting gigs coming to him. I mean, he doesn't really have to do anything because the AV guys got all their people lined up, all their marketing good to go, and whenever someone says, hey, we need a speaker, they say, oh, we got this guy, and then bam, he just he just has a, a business just like that. It's very similar to like if you're a real estate agent, if you were a real estate agent, one of the things that I would go after if I was a real estate agent is investors. I would look for investors because investor will simply say like, okay, we're just gonna buy all kinds of houses, sell all kinds of houses, and because you have this one client, you now have 10 houses that you're gonna sell. And so it's very similar to what I do with the speaking and what you need to do with the speaking, what Jason did with the speaking. And that's how he filled up his, his schedule with really just one email. He just contacted these AV guys. But uh, really what you want to do is look for suppliers. That's what they're called is you look for suppliers and you just see who their clients are. And then uh, you, you, what I would do a lot of is sometimes I wouldn't even contact these suppliers. I would go to their websites and just like with speakers is I would look at their clients, see who they actually did stuff for, and then I would contact those clients for future events. And that's something you can do. Now, in the Speak Pro Academy, I actually listed in the resources section over 7,000 suppliers that you guys can contact in general. There's a website that I link to, and you can. there's over 7,000 suppliers. There's a lot of people. There's AV people. There's caterers. There's all kinds of people, uh, production companies. But this is a very simple thing that you can do today, tomorrow whenever you want. And once again, when you do fill up your calendar, you do make a lot of money. I want 99.9% .9 of it just because.